Good afternoon, viewers. This is your friend Leon. I want to show you a new one, but I also want to show you a new way if you want to connect your own smoke detector without uh, uh, run it without a battery. Electricity, this is an easy way uh, for people that don't have one, always own. You don't have to worry about your battery unless you. And then the electric to play out, you got a back battery hookup right there. See that 12 volt right there? I mean, 9 volt battery. That's what the smoke detector run by. It is connected right now by a 9 volt battery. And the cord is running, as you can see, into the socket. That's the one underneath. Also, you know up front there, you're familiar, but this, this is already on my YouTube channel, Google+. Plus. And Facebook, this top one right here, that is connected, as you know, to this. And it's been that way for, I don't know, I guess I've been here about five years now. But anyway, that's how I show you. In case you want to, you don't, I got one in the garage here. But, you know, you can make it and put it anywhere you want to. Uh, when they electric like this here, uh, high, low, or just plug it in any place especially if you're a smoker and stuff like that. But you can catch that on my YouTube channel. What I'm showing you now, you won't catch it on none of them because I just finished it today. Okay, well, I, let me see. I was going to let you see it fly so you know, but I think you've seen it flash already. Okay, this one doesn't flash because this is one. This is a 9-volt hookup, okay? Fit right into the electric socket you see there. It's just shorter, no cord. See here? goes right into there. Right into there, into the plug, just like the one you see right there, already plugged up and on. The reason that doesn't burn up, all of the protection is built in there. You set it for what you want it to be, and it'll do that 9-volt uh, system here. And you know I done had it quite a while, and you know it's worked. And I'm trying to see if it'll flash wire so you can get an idea. I'm telling you. The truth, but if you haven't, you can see it on my YouTube channel or other channel. But I want to show you this new, and I'll be off of here. Thought I can get that to flash. Okay. Other way, you see they all plugged up, and this one here, if you don't hear nothing, if you if you hear anything, that means it's uh, not plugged or need short or whatever. But it doesn't need that. But uh, let me just show you here. These all run. These these things run by nine volt battery. You know that your smoke detector. I just years ago I just made my own smoke detector with this. Who what regulate a nine volt battery? And you can catch that on my YouTube if you need to. This is a new way. That's why I wanted to show you this one. See the plug plug under there. It's a regular household current plug. Plug into this here socket socket there. Okay, and then it is. Got a nine volt clip. You see that? Remember, I buy these at my favorite store. I won't take, won't be given a plug because people may not like that. I mean, the company or the network. Do you know I buy these at my favorite store? They're nine volt hookup. And the, all you got inside of your uh, uh, smoke detector is positive and negative where the nine volt battery hook up and go, as you can see those two posts right here. One of them go to the positive and the other one go to the negative. These two posts, this right here, the nine volt battery, as you know, fit right in here where my hand at. This is the back of the battery. This is the front of the battery. And that's easy to see. See the wires. The wires come in there, right there. I think you see right here. Right there. Those are the wires that come to it when you put a battery in there. When you put one of these battery here in there, they go like this, okay? They go just like this. Okay, that's where it's going here because the positive is here where you see the white red wire on it. So that battery go like this here. Okay, so the, the, the idea well, with the battery out of it, the, the positive and negative post is still there. Well, why you don't need a battery? I have a nine volt hookup. See it there? You can buy these. They ain't, they ain't limited to just me. You know, you can get them at my favorite store. I just thought I'd show you because you know I got these clips, but they sell the clip and this at my favorite store. If you want to have your own smoke detector without using battery, 
and it's a little, you can put it anywhere you want to, as you can see, anywhere you got a light plug up socket. But you know, I got two kinds. That's why I made showing you the different kinds so you know. You know, this one you'll find on YouTube going right into the plug. That's the top one you see is on. This one you won't find because I just got through with it today. This is a nine volt hookup you can buy at most electric places. I won't give it no name now because I'm not supposed to be doing that on gas. But anyway, these are not, you see the. Ain't nothing but they, they nine volt hookup is already protected, coated into a wire. They coat it, you stick the wire in just like you see me got it right here. The positive and the positive and negative, or you can solder it, put a drop of solder in there. It doesn't make any difference. Okay, but I probably you probably want to solder it, I guess. Um, and because you may want to put the the, the 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 back of it back on so it can hook up. Okay, like this one has got a hook up there. So it's it's not raw in the back. I did this so I can show you the inside of it and how it worked. Okay, so the battery, as you know, go right there. Uh, but this can see what it is. I'm saying when the electric goes out, if your electric is off, you can always use this battery to plug in there. I I do have a battery already installed in there. When the electric goes out, that can automatically kick on. You just seen the flash, I believe. You can automatically kick that on. Okay, so let me, I don't want to be too long on this. Okay, and I'm already long enough. So this is what you see here, and this is my new, uh, this is the uh, 920. I decide to show you a new way if you don't, if you want, or if you don't have a plug-in smoke detector that costs you somewhere 10 to $12 or more, you can do it yourself with this plug for about, I guess, about 3 or $4 right here, and that's all there is to it. And, you know, you got the battery come with the with the smoke detector anyway. So, you know, I'm just saying, you know, you buy the smoke detector and that's all you need. Because the battery, no, some battery don't come with them. But if it do, then you got your battery and everything. All you need to do is buy this plug. I'm just showing you. This plug is what make all the difference that I'm showing you. Okay. Here, I had to do a little work. But that's okay. Because I made it along a card. And that's the reason for that. Okay. Now you see, Leon, new smoke detector plug in and take it anywhere you want to to electric socket it's the what control the amount of electricity is in this socket of course just like the amount control in that socket there but i'm just showing you how I, this this is sealed okay and it's got it all information on the back this one here as you know you regulate the what you want to do for the 9 volt battery that's the difference. It's the same thing as this, only here you have to find the, the voltage to regulate to plug it in here. This already got it set. That's what I'm trying to tell you. You can buy them already set with a 9-volt hookup on, that, on there. And that's it. I'll, I'll cut this off, and then I'll show you by un, uh, taking that wide of the socket. Okay, now I got it off. As you can see, that well, you just seen the flip. It'll, it'll do that. I hope you caught it. Okay, now you know that plug is off here, so you can really get an idea. Now, I'm going to pull these wires out because I want you to see. Okay? Right? Here me, here me go now. I mean, here I go. I Watch me. I don't know where I better set that. Okay, that's... Wait a minute. Okay, I'm taking the positive out of the positive. Now, you could know you can solder now. I'm trying... I did this so I can show you from scratch. Okay, that's positive. It's off now. And this is negative. And then pull it out now. See, because you can push them down in there and they'll stick too. That's what they're a little wide. But I don't want you to do that. I'm just saying you could solder it in, you you know, if you do a lot of soldering. Okay, that's that. Okay, now to show you the balance part of it, let me unplug it here. You want to always unplug it, even if it's some more. Now I cut this back on. That go back on to that. That keep that from hollering if it ain't over. Because it ain't in unplug. The power's not out. Okay, now I got this unplugged. Always make sure this is unplugged. Do this before you. But this is what I want to show you. And this is probably something you haven't seen. Or you may have seen it. Okay, this is what I told you. This is what I want to show you. Okay, let me pull it out. This is it here. See there? That's the plug again. That's the 9 volt. Now you see, it made only for 9 volt. You can't put no more there. That is right there. Okay, that's all there is to it. As a nine volt hookup, right there you see. Okay, let's turn it up and then I'm saying goodbye. 
nine bow hookup fit right in your socket. I just showed you. You can know you can buy these at my favorite store. That clamp right on the battery. I don't need to go back over you. Know it clamp right on there. And you know where your positive and negative right here, right here. And then I'll show you this right here so you'll get a good idea. Okay. That's positive right here. That's negative. Okay. That's the battery. Good you go down just like I showed you. Okay. Let me see. Do I have enough? I'm trying to do it. I shouldn't, but I think you know all of this anyway. But I want people that don't know that they want this. You don't have to want it, but it goes like that. There it is. Okay. I'll pick it up. See what I'm saying now? That's the way it goes. That is a smoke detector, the way you buy it. I think you buy it with the battery in there. That's positive and negative. This is positive over here, negative here. Okay. And that's all the to it. Remember, it, 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 this goes on the in, inside of there, but it's, it's, it's already built in. But I'm just showing you how you can do. Okay. This is Leon with a new information to show you that you can do your own battery. You know, you can buy them this way now. They sell, I mean, they, you can buy the smoke detector with the hook up in there. But guess what? And the battery. They only allow you 10 years. After 10 years, after 10 years, there's no more good. Okay? So mine go on as long as electricity. It's got no time limit. As long as electricity, that's it. Now you've seen. Have a good day.